Welcome to Microsoft Teams. Teams is a collaboration app to help your teams stay organized and have conversations all in one place. When you open Teams, on the left-hand side, you'll see six icons. Today, we're going to talk about the first three, starting with Teams. Here you can see a list of all the teams you are on. Each team is made up of channels and channels are usually named by topic or department. Within your channels, you can do things like sharing files and collaborating on them without having to leave teams. Within your channels, you will notice that there are tabs along the top. These tabs can be customized to show different applications and files. There are hundreds of apps that you can add into Teams. The one that we have on the screen now is OneNote. As well as all of the Microsoft applications, you could add things like Adobe Sign, Trello, Poly, or LucidChart. In the chat area of Teams, you will find a list of recent chat conversations. You can pin conversations to the top of this list for easy access. Along the top of a chat window, you will notice that you have a similar tab layout as you do in the channel area. These can also be customized and these tabs will only be viewable by those within the conversation. Also, along the top of the chat window, you will notice three purple icons. These allow you to video call, phone call or share your screen directly with the participants within that chat. You can start a group conversation by clicking the square with a pencil in the top left corner of your screen and typing in the names of the people that you want to join the conversation. This new chat window works exactly the same as the previous chat window, only you're sharing information with multiple people rather than one on one. Within the activity section of Teams, you'll find a roundup of all the news that's happening in Teams, which is relevant to you. You'll find things like at mentions for you personally and for the teams that you're in, and also replies and reacts to any messages that you might have posted. That concludes our introduction to Teams. You can do a whole lot more with Teams, like hosting webinars or using it as your phone system. If you'd like to find out more, please visit our website at power-net.com.au or give us a call on 1300 892 692.